Hey Fresh fans, this is Spencer here with the Aquaponicals from the Aquaponics Source. And uh, we're going to show you guys how we set up this system today. So first things first, we're going to go through all the different items that come with your Aquaponicals kit. And then we'll show how they all go together. So, got your manual here. Then you got your system, which comes in three parts. The sump tank fish tank and the grow bed up top and the grow bed you can see has let's see this is where the water comes in this is the siphon and this is the overflow just in case of emergency and then we have a small pump standard uh, here we go submersible pump And what we do with that is put it down into the sump tank, which has a fill two line here. You always want to keep the water at least uh, within two inches of that line. The pump goes in like so. With uh, a space for the cord to come out here, which is nice. From there, we can put the fish tank right on. Actually, before we do that, let's add our water. So we're going to fill it up to the line. And I have here a water from my larger outside aquaponics system. And uh, normally you would use uh, water from your faucet or hose. And for that, they include dechlorinator over here and uh, nitrifying bacteria to help you get your system started up quickly and correctly. But for our sake, we're, or the sake of ease, we're going to use our own aquaponics water. And here, let me show you the inside of the sump. Here you have the fill two here line. The pump is just a smidge above the bottom so that it doesn't run dry. Add in our water. There we go. Let's bring that back over here into sight. So now we have our pump in the sump with the water. We're going to put the fish tank on top. So the fish tank is just a nice clear, uh, gla uh, not glass, but plastic uh, enclosure. There's an overflow here that allows water from the fish tank to feed back into the sump in case of there's a flood. And this tube here, this tube here, make sure you guys can see it from any angle, that's where the, uh, the hose from the pump is going to come from. So I'll show you guys how to install that now. We have our little tiny pump. It comes with a hose. There's a simple attachment right on the side there. We'll put that back in. Then that hose goes up into that middle hole that I was just showing you. And you simply put the sump right on top, or the fish, the fish tank on top, top of the sump. From there, you're going to take your sump tank. Here you go. And there's a little gasket right here that goes into the center hole right here. And that's to make sure that there's a nice tight uh, seal on that pump and you don't get any spillage. So that just goes right on top like that. The final part, uh, actually there's two more parts, excuse me. So in your fish tank, this is uh, the spillover cup, just like so. Before you do that, you want to set this uh, O-ring into the tank so that you can include your measuring stick, nice and handy here. So we'll mark the level, and this way we can always know, even though the fish tank is full, the level of the sump. 
because remember we never want to let the sump drop uh, more than two inches below that fill to here line. So here we have the orange marked up with the O-ring. If that drops more than two inches down, right about here, so if the water, or if the orange marker ever gets to this O-ring, then I know that I need to add more water to my system. And it's pretty handy. So then we'll put the cap on top, and we're just about ready. We're going to add the grow bed with the O-ring in there. The final step is to add this cool little siphon here. So this is a traditional media bed siphon, but made uh, very small. And it'll go inside of the sump tank, like so. You can see there's an integrated me uh, media guard. This is the bell. And just like this. So from there, we just add in our media, like this. this is, and this comes with the system. Everything uh, in this video so far comes with the system. Should be just enough. And I did not wash this, so it might be dirty. And there you have it. So you add in the media, and uh, then from there, the system's ready to go. You'd add in the rest of your water. And we don't have any fish today, but we will add in the water. And there you have it. I guess we'll get, need to get more water. But for the sake of this video, I think that'll do. Uh, from here, we would fill up the fish tank, put this on top, and then from there, you just plug in your system. And that's all. That's the aquaponicals from the aquaponic source. And we'll continue to update this page with videos of how this thing grows so you guys can see firsthand just how cool this system is. And I look forward to talking to you again.